Hello everyone, congratulations. We're now at the last section of the 2020 NBS Sharing Dance Choreography. Bravo for all your hard work so far. And let's now continue and do the last section of the dance. This is gonna have three parts. A first part that we'll learn together, a second part that we've already learned, a repeat, and then our final closing movement. So let's start with our feet nice and wide. And I want you to have lots of power and energy in your arms. Our arms are going to cross our body and then open. And then we do that again, cross and open. Just keep feeling that, cross and open and cross and open. Good, and you've probably seen our arms that there's a really, a feeling of almost throw or power or striking the end of our movement. Really want you to feel the texture of that movement and really push with your arms as we do this. It's going to take four counts. We're going to go cross, open, cross, and open. Okay, let's try that together. Bend your knees, ready? Five, six, seven, here we go. This is cross, open, cross, open. Very nice. Good job, everyone. Let's practice it one more time. Five, six, seven, ready, going one, two, three, four. From there, our right arm, the high arm, is going to wrap around our waist. Then our left arm is going to do the same, wrapping around your arm. And it's actually going to grab on top of my elbow. So my left arm is grabbing on top of my right elbow. Let's try just those wraps again. So I wrap five, I wrap six. Now I'm holding that elbow and just give that arm a pull. See how that feels. See how you can manipulate your right arm by pulling on your left? So the next movement, it's sort of going to feel like you're sending a Spider-Man web out of your wrist and connecting it to where the, the wall and the floor meet on the left side of the room. So grabbing your elbow, you're going to pull back and go whoosh, reaching out. Yeah, and there's a lot of power and energy in that movement, make it very, very sharp. So we have four crosses and opens. One, two, three, four counts, then wrap, wrap, reach. All right, let's try just that much. Five, six, seven, here we go, and cross, open, cross, open, wrap, pull, reach. Good. From there, this elbow is going to pull back and my hand will come across my body until I have a very open pose on the opposite side. Then I can start the same phrase again with the cross. Cross, open, cross, open, wrap, wrap, reach, pull. Very nice, everyone. Why don't we practice that one more time? Nice wide legs, powerful arms, five, six, Seven, here we go, it's a cross. Open, cross, open, wrap, wrap, reach and pull and cross. Open, cross, good job. Wrap, wrap, reach and up. Very good, from there we're going to do a part we've learned already before. Do you remember when we went shoulder, shoulder, arms, arms, wrap, tick, reach, breathe. We're going to repeat that section now, but it is a little bit faster than it was before. So we're really going to have to hustle through those same movements. Why don't we practice this section and we'll practice it a little closer to this faster tempo with the right shoulder. Five, six, ready, here we go. Dive shoulder, shoulder, arms, arms, wrap, tick, reach and breathe. How did that go? Good, let's practice it one more time at that tempo. Ready, five, six, shoulder goes digging, go one, two, three, four, wrap, tick, reach and Good. Now the next part, if you remember, goes contract, contract and double contraction. Now, since this is so much faster, we're actually going to plant our feet and rather than step from side to side, we're going to allow ourselves to pivot from side to side. So stand with your feet nice and wide and I want you to turn your body to face the right and your right foot may slip a little bit to the back. So that's our right lunge. Then to change sides, we're just going to pivot on our feet to face the left 
and then pivot back on our feet to do the double on this side. Okay, so just try those feet for me. Single, single, double. Five, six, ready to pivot. Go one, two, one, two. All right, let's try adding in the arms we know. So it's the same contraction we practiced before, now with a pivot of the legs. Five, six, seven, and eight. Go contract, contract, and double contraction. From there, just finish the phrase the same as before. Right arm, left arm, breathe in, and drop. Very nice. So that one pivot is the one change in this phrase. Why don't we go back and try it again from our shoulder, continuing through the contractions. Five, six, seven, and diving with the shoulder. Shoulder, paint, paint, sweep, tick, reach, breathe, into go, push, and push, and double, push, go right, left, go up, come down. Very good, everyone. Why don't we try to connect that together now? So let's start from cross, open, cross, open, wrap, grab, reach, pull. Remember, we do that twice through. And then we're going to do our shoulder section only one time. All right, let's give it a try. Five, six, seven, here we go. This is cross, open, cross, open, wrap, five, grab, six, reach, seven, and cross, open, cross, ready to wrap, 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 and, and shoulders go one, two, sweep, sweep, reach, tick, grow, breathe, push, push, double, contract, and up, suspend, up, and drop. Very well done, everyone. I think we should practice that one more time before we put on the ending. There isn't much left to do and you're doing an excellent job. So let's start from our cross and our open. Here we go. Ready, set, here we go. This is cross, open, cross, open, wrap, five, grab, six, and Spider-Man, pull, cross, open, cross, open, wrap, reach, pull, shoulders go, one, two, sky, sky, wrap, tick, reach and breathe and push, push, double, push, float, float, up and drop. Very nice. So let's learn the very last part of the dance now. Just like at the beginning, we have a very short phrase that we'll repeat four times through. So we did our drop. First, we're going to reach on a high right diagonal. I just have a soft pointing hand. And then on the high left diagonal. Then I'm going to reach down low diagonal and low diagonal. All right, let's try that. One count per movement. Five, six, seven, and eight. One, two, three, four. From here, I'm going to bring my feet underneath my body so I'm nice and stable and open my chest high lift to the sky. Gather my fist and my hand up like we did at the beginning of the dance and then do that blow out. Ready? Good. So the whole phrase goes high, high, low, low, high lift, gather and whew. yeah let's practice that we repeat it four times through but the very last time the ending is going to be different so there are only three of these pushes down towards the floor all right trying this ending with the diagonals five six seven eight high high low low high lift high lift in and whew. High, high, low, low, high lift, high lift, in, in. Third one. High, high, low, low, high lift, high lift, in, in. Last one. High, high, 
low, low, high lift, high lift. Then from there, you're going to tuck your chin in, curve your body, and then scoop with your head to come up to the front. And you'll see that my right leg slid forward as I did that. When I show you what that looks like from the side. So my chest is lifting up. I'm going to tuck my chin in towards my chest, curve my spine, slide forward with my right foot, and then scoop under to come up. That's it, very good. So the action is a, a wave of a movement that moves forward in space. Great, so why don't we try one more time our high diagonal, low diagonal, all those sets finishing with the scoop forward to the end. Feet nice and wide, five, six, ready, here we go. This is high, high, low, low, up, up, gather, and one, high, high, low, low, up, up, gather, and high, high, low, and a low, up, up, gather, and last one, two, three, four, five, six, go, seven, and eight, and finish. Great. And actually, when we finish, I'm reaching my arms out because we're going to try to connect again like we did before by holding onto shoulders. And you may be thinking that we're a little far apart to do that. So what we're going to do is take our movements in the high, high, low, low to allow us to sort of rock our way closer together. So we're moving our way through space during this section, and that will allow us to do our fourth one, finishing grabbing on and touching each other's shoulders. Great, so at the end we can finish as a team just like we did in the group section of the dance. All right, so why don't we go now through all of section six with counts. So remember there are three parts. There's the cross and open that we learned today. There's the shoulder and shoulder that we've learned before. And it finishes with the reaches to the diagonals and that's our last movement of the dance. All right, so with me, with counts, a little slower than the tempo of the music. Five, six, seven, and eight. Cross, open, cross, open, wrap, and wrap, and throw, and pull. One, two, three, four, five, and six, and seven, Shoulders go one, two, sweep, three, four, wrap, five, tick, six, reach, seven, breathe, to go contract, contract, and double, reach, and up, 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 and drop to go high, high, low, low, high lift, high lift, in, and high, high, low, low, High lift, high lift, in, in, <laughs> high, high, low, low. High lift, high lift, in, in, <laughs> last time go high, high, low, low. High lift, high lift, sweep and chasse and finish. Bravo everyone, I think it's time we tried that with some music. Ready, shoulders. Push. Reach. Up. Last one. 